They also had the young missionaries. We're gonna take your land. Do, do, do. You guys can sleep in the sand. Do, 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 do. We're gonna build on every inch of rock and give you guys the chicken pox. I feel like I should be eulogizing this guy, but he's alive. And really alive, like not just breathing, not just having a pulse. He's out there living. He was on To Tell the Truth. Have you seen the new To Tell the Truth? Do you even know what I'm talking about? You're probably too cool to know. To Tell the Truth was an old show from the 20th century where three contestants would get up and say who they were, what they did. Oh, no, no, no. They would just say what they did. So they would say, I am a Hollywood pimple popper. I am a Hollywood pimple popper. I am a Hollywood pimple popper. And then a panel of celebrities has to ask them questions and figure out which one is the pimple popper. Norman Lear was on the new To Tell the Truth. And I loved him. He was great. He was really good at the game too. And in one of the rounds, he refused to vote because there was someone who claimed to be a burlesque dancer. And he said, if you don't know this or da 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 da, you obviously don't know what you're doing. I'm not voting. I don't, I, don't, I don't know why he stood off like that, but you know what? After you've created all of that television, launched all of these careers, not just in the acting realm, but in directing, in writing, in producing, in training new producers, I think you have a right to sit out around to tell the truth. Norman Lear. I don't know where my life would be without Norman Lear. He provided so much content on the airwaves when we had three channels that were commercial, one that was public, and if you lived in a big enough city, a couple of ultra high frequency channels. And then you had syndication on the ultra high frequency channels. So there was a lot of Norman Lear, good times, all in the family, Maud. All of them related to one another also. It was this weird kind of thing where the spin-off was somehow connected to this big solar system, all having to do with Norman Lear in his grandpa fishing cap with his cleverness and his wisdom and his absolute comfort at letting other people make the wisecracks while he made the wise decisions.